And if you're a Blender artist, you're probably looking for some amazing Blender add-ons and assets that you can work with. And today we do have a good number of add-ons and asset tools that will help your next project and make your life easy. From geometry nodes to add-ons all the way to physics and assets, there is definitely something for you. And with that said, let's get right into it. Personally dubbed as the only procedural tool for artists, Copify from CG Matters is here. This is a fantastic and useful curve tool that makes you wonder why you don't have this tool yet. This geometry based curve tool allows you to procedurally generate barbed wires, chains, clouds, curtains, feathers, generate three different types of fences, dangling cables, rainbows, road, roll around curves, ropes, rivers, snow, tentacles, and flow. With an amazing set of parameters that you can work with, this just simply makes every other curve tool that you've probably had redundant. And like we know, CG Matters have created a good number of tools prior to this and it's just amazing the kind of things that you can do with this. Furthermore, the Copify tool comes in two variants which one of them deals with you trying this for free. So just in case you like to give it a try before you purchase it, then this is also available. Creating feathers can be complicated as they require meticulous processes to achieve. And that is why Jablaya has put together the Nuja Feather and Plumage tool. This is a clean and interesting procedural feather creation tool for making complex feathers and plumages. We control some parameters to shape, control density, scraggle, add noise, and weather the feathers. With additional set of controls for making some very interesting textures on the feathers and also playing with the transformation. And this doesn't stop there. Once you're done, you can bake and go destructive where you can sculpt on the meshes and get the most out of it. And just like when you work with procedural tools in Blender, you can simply paint, comb and also control the feathers however you want. And if you're looking for something that you can work with on the go, this comes to the 150 baked feathers, 25 procedural materials and a lot more. So just in case you've been thinking about a procedural feather tool that you can work with in Blender, and you've been wondering how you can get started with it, then the Nuja tool is available and you can start creating that amazing feathers for your characters right now. So we've seen different kinds of animation tools for cars and we've also seen wonderful car tools that you can work with, but we haven't actually seen a physics based vehicle rigging add-on like the RBC. RBC is a wonderful add-on that allows you effortlessly create realistic physics based vehicle rigs in Blender. This extremely simplifies the whole idea of creating physics based vehicle rigs. So, just in case you're thinking about rigging, you can do this in any way you want. You can set up a custom rig if this is what you're going for, and if you like to do a quick rig, all you need to do is to select the vehicle and you can hit on the quick rig button and automatically this will create rigs for the model. And once these rigs are created, you do have parameters that you can use to drive, steer and also brake the car wherever you want. There is literally no need for you to start rigging or probably start keyframing these things by hand yourself. Additionally, if you like to push the boundaries of what you can get, there is also a setup section which you can use to set up the vehicle, you can set up various parts of the body, and you can add both collisions, collections, and extras of the vehicle as you proceed. This doesn't only work for vehicles, as you can also use this for motorbikes as well. There's also some very interesting controls that you can play with, and you can start creating that stunning and cinematic animation that you've always wanted. Additionally, the collision tool also allows you to set up collisions with other objects. So for those who are thinking about playing with this, or probably you're looking for an add-on that gives you an intuitive interface for easy setup and customization of rigs, then you should consider grabbing RBC from Aka Studios, which is an amazing physics-based vehicle rigging add-on. So, you want to make procedural trees, and you want them to follow a particular form that you've designed. Well, any trees is the exact tool that you're looking for. This add-on makes personalized tree creation an easy breeze, with a very few set of controls that will allow you style your trees however you want, with maximum control over your creation, with features that allows you model unique trees based on shapes and curves, and beautifully, this also ships with an automatic UV which can be done in seconds. At the same time, any trees comes with 40 premium quality fast to render leaves which are ready for your projects. You can also animate them to get some interesting movement and if you like to use your own materials or your own leaves you also have options of importing them and for parameters you do have parameters for the branch the gravity distortion the growth resolution of the trees that you're creating and also the smoothness and randomization of individual branches the beautiful thing about any trees is you have full control over the trees and how you choose to create your trees are totally up to you 
And as a 3D artist, in most cases, you need references to get things going. Managing these references can come with a price, and that is where Blender Ref makes life easy. Blender Ref is a Blender add-on for images and video reference management on your viewport. This is really cool for those who are into animating, modeling, and sculpting, with a 1.1 update allowing you to bring in GIFs and WebM files. Additionally, media information, display sizes, format, and number of frames that these images contain can also be displayed on the tool, especially if you're trying to reference a particular motion for animation and you'd like to know the number of frames that you'll be working with. Additionally, unlike other tools where you have to force the app to be over your viewport, this add-on will be part of your Blender, which means that you don't need to leave Blender interface to preview these videos or take a look at the references. So for those who are into animating, sculpting or modeling, and you like to work with references in Blender, then the Blend Ref is a wonderful tool that you should consider getting. If you're a fan of sailing, then you'll be a fan of the real-time ship simulator. This is a Blender add-on that works with the ocean modifier and uses the physical base solver to simulate ship dynamics. This can be used for different kinds of objects and it is super simple and powerful to use. Of course, this comes with a set of parameters that allows you to easily simulate and bake keyframes. At the same time, you can control the flotability, the buoyancy, velocity, and so much more. So if you're into sailing or you're creating a project that deals with the sea and you're wondering how you can get started with this, then you can consider taking a look at Ignacio's real-time ship simulator that is currently doing a 35% off and grab this while offer last. So this is more like it. Tell me what you guys think about this one in the comment section. And of course, if you like this video or you learned something from this, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And until I see you guys in the next one, peace.